having this coefficient here, having a coefficient of x squared that is not one, changes everything. Oh, man. So when you spot this, here is what we do. I'm gonna show you this process. Obviously, that is my job. And then we're gonna run with it. Yeah, do your job, sir. <laughs> <laughs> so the first thing we do is we're gonna do this times that. And we're gonna write it out again as 2x squared plus 5x plus four. What? From this it? point on, this is a little trick. Don't worry about the necessarily the why we do it. Uh -huh. So that times that, write it out again. And then we do like we normally do. A couple sets of brackets here. Now this time, remembering that we have this coefficient of x here, we're gonna write two x in the front of each. Now don't worry necessarily that that times that doesn't make that. Again, it's just a process. We just have to do this structure. Mm -hmm. But now, once again, we're looking for two numbers that times to make that and add or subtract to make that. So what are we gonna go for? One and five. No. Nope. Times to make, sorry? Times to make this. Yeah. And add to make that. But well, one times four, one times four, one and one four. One and four, that's yeah. the one. One and we got four. Very common mistake though, when you're, when you're dealing with sort of one and something, the four and the five, very easy to get mixed up. One and four, what combination it's not that of one easy. And you four? got it wrong, bro. What you're combination dumb, of one bruv. and four makes positive five? One and four, positive one and positive four. Plus and plus. Now that's how you do it, yeah? <laughs> now this fun <laughs> you, man. The final step here is we times something at the beginning. Yeah. So we're gonna need to divide something at the end. So with these brackets, if you can divide either of the brackets by anything, then you do it. Okay. So can either of these brackets be divided by something? In terms of the well, values of no. one of them. Either of them. The one on the right can be divided by, by two. two yeah. So we do divide it by two. Do oh. That's the way it works. So this one stays two X plus one, X plus two. And then you will see that two X times the X makes two X squared. The one times two makes two. And that is the process of how it works. Oh. Now, it is really important to go through repetition of this because the structure, it's a little bit tricky, it's a little bit fiddly. There's a little few random things in there, but I promise you, once you commit it to memory, it's very, very simple. Calm. Yeah. So I memorize this one. Really times the front one, times the, times the, times co the coefficient. The first coefficient to the end number. Yeah. yeah. And then you and find then, the factors. And then rip in and then divide one of the brackets or divide whatever's divisible yes. yeah. does it have to be by the same that coefficient number or is it divided or, by whatever it can be divided almost by? always yes but sometimes if this coefficient is like a six mm -hmm. then you times six of course then maybe you're dividing it by two maybe divided by three maybe divided by six itself maybe yeah just look at it as whatever can be divided gets divided Calm. okay